Hey guys, I'm just uh, walking alone this morning. It's day 28 or 9, I think it's day 29. Um, and by the end of today, I should have walked 400 miles across Spain. Um, that's pretty, it's pretty epic. Um, sorry, I'm walking again. I'm also along a road again, so there's gonna be traffic noise. Like, well, you can see it coming up. <sighs> but you can see the beginnings of the sunrise behind me. Uh, it's gorgeous out here. Ever since, just before Fonce Bedon, or however you say that, um, it went from just like flat, plain, empty fields to just hills and gorgeous landscapes. It's been amazing. Um, it's beautiful out here. I mean, even along the highway, it's beautiful. Uh, but anyways, I'm really, really enjoying myself out here. I'm having very few moments of like being questioning being out here, or even like when some annoying or tough things happened in the beginning, it was like every little thing that went wrong was terrifying because you didn't know if it was going to spiral out of control and make it so it stopped your trip. Um, and it was just everything I found was really overwhelming. And not only that, but like I'm so far away, so, and obviously out of my element, so I'm not exactly sure how to go about getting help with various issues. But everybody here is so helpful, like, it's so funny. I don't even know how many times, like, the second you step off course, someone is there, and like, they'll be driving by and they'll stop. And they'll be like, wait, 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 wait. Not that way, Camino is that way. And um, even just yesterday, Matt and I walked into this town and um, we got up to this bridge and the bridge obviously went two different directions and we were just like looking back and forth and looking back and forth. And we're like, we think it's this way. And we started to walk and we didn't even get 10 steps and someone across the way on their balcony like whistled and waved and we looked up at them and they're like pointing the other direction. We waved and, and said thank you and kept going. And I mean, they were pretty far away too. So they had to have been watching us <laughs> looking back and forth, looking confused, and then waited to see what we did. But, um, but he, people here are so helpful. It's ridiculous. Like you almost don't even, especially I think as Americans, we don't know how to trust it. I mean, now we're used to it, so we do. But it's just, it's so weird how helpful and nice everybody is. I mean, obviously it's nice, but it's so great out here. Like the pilgrims are really nice and helpful. Whenever we can be for each other, we do everything we can to help one another. And then the, the locals, even most of them, do, they don't speak English. Some of them speak a very small amount of English, but, but they do everything they can to help you. And they'll just talk to you like you do understand Spanish. And it's hilarious, because you're like, uh-huh, or uh, no Nintendo. But they just kind of smile and keep going. Um, but. It's, it's amazing out here. I'm having so much fun. Uh, I know you guys probably won't see this till after I'm back, but I just, just felt the need to do a video because I'm just in such a great place. Like now it finally feels like a vacation. Um, whereas before it was hard work and it's still hard work. I mean, my legs are still killing me. I hobble around town at night. Um, Tons of things are still going wrong, but at this point it's habit, so it's like, eh, whatever. My legs are just gonna hurt today, but I'm gonna have some beautiful views and beautiful experiences, so why not? <sighs> but yeah, it's it's been amazing. I'll, I'm already really sad at the thought of it being over, uh, but I'm trying not to let that get to me because I still have a little over a week and I really want to enjoy it without that sadness being attached to it. Um, but it's been wonderful. I'm having a great time. Buen Camino.